Here's up guys, in this video we're going to be going over the effects section, namely the hyper and dimension effects. So you're going to want to go into your effect tab here. Keep in mind that we have a clean saw wave selected. We can verify that, which is good. Um, I'll just make that a little bit like that. Alright, so how you enable and disable effects is by clicking on the toggle switch here. And you can enable them, you can change the order and uh, all sorts of fun stuff and they all run in series i'll bring this back up here because we're just going to be focusing on the hyper and dimension effect so hyper is basically whatever this number here is is the amount of times what the output is of your the osc section goes into here and it splits it up into or well, right now it's four splits it up into four bands and uh detunes them and then modulates the rate of how it's detuned making a hyper saw effect um, we'll stick with four and we'll have the mix all the way down so we can hear what's going on so we have i'll start out with a clean saw and then i'll turn up the mix and you can be able to see and hear what it does Right, if we have it set to two, right, you'll notice that there's two saws going on and they're creating a stereo kind of panning effect. We can speed up or slow down the rate of how they go in and out and just move around, which is pretty lush. So right now it's at zero, it's not moving at all. And if we have detuned to zero, they're not. They're not detuned at all and zero would be like nothing so we'll set it back to seven which is a pretty cool effect with the rate we'll uh control shift to reset the rate and uh we'll bring the mix all the way up here so what the mix does is that sets the amount so it mix the dry with the wet and uh yeah we'll bring the detune up and you can hear what's going on And the retrig, it will start them all off in the same uh, phase, I, I think. So it's all the same phase, and then they go out of tune. So we'll give you an example of that. Right. And so if I do this, you can really hear it. it starts at the same time, right? Oops, wrong one. Right. We go retrig off. Then they're all running freely. And this is different than the uh, unison on uh, the oscillator because that's per voice, remember. Um, and the effect is whatever is summed out of the osc section, that's going into this. So, you, so it's a way to kind of stack your instances of serum and uh, get a nice little effect there. Anyway, all right. We'll take the mix all the way down and I'll show you the dimension so the dimension it's uh it has four delay lines and they all modulate in and out of um the 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 amplitude modulates and so it gives it like that kind of pseudo i'm not really sure how it works but there's an ensemble and uh uh reactor and this this same one based off of i assume it's based off of the one in massive so it's a kind of a neat way to wide note uh, mono sounds and uh, make them like pop out in the mix. It's a pretty cool thing. There's also a, a standalone one from Xfer in the free section. So turn up the mix. So increase in size um, sets the amount of delay between, you know, it's like it has effect. See that? We have set size a little bit smaller. And uh, yeah, that's the um, hyper end dimension, kind of a weird way of going about it. But yeah, um, hope you enjoy. Take care, and we'll be back with more stuff.